The Yampa White Green Basin Roundtable is spearheading an integrated water management plan for the Bear, Elk, and Yampa Rivers. This plan will identify and support projects that are good for both the river's health and water users. The Lower Elkhead Creek Restoration Project, which is partially funded by a Basin Roundtable grant, is a good example of a project that helps both local agriculture and the river's ecosystem thrive. My name is Keith Pankey. I've been on the creek for 69 years plus. So this is my Uncle Winfield, and he's been on the creek a long time, so. About 87 years. This is where we raise our hay, and this is where we winter our livestock. There's a lot of erosion. Late summer, I cannot irrigate, use my water rights because of the structure being so far down the creek. And without the creek, without the hay, we're not able to raise livestock. My name is Caitlin Vo, and I am Trout Unlimited's Yampa White River Basin Project Coordinator and a partner biologist for the Natural Resources Conservation Service, NRCS. Elkhead Creek is a tributary to the Yampa River located northeast of the city of Craig. Since the 19th century, it has been used predominantly for hay production and livestock grazing. Hi, my name is Lorraine Katchek and this is my son Blaine. Our family has lived out here on Elkhead um, Creek for 20 years. I'd say the biggest issues we've noticed out here is the erosion of the banks. Uh, especially in the springtime during high water. We're losing, over the 20 years, we've lost quite a bit of ground to erosion just being washed away because of the high water. The proposed restoration work here on Lower Elkhead Creek has been a multi-purpose, multi-benefit project from the beginning. There's, of course, the agricultural component of protecting ag infrastructure, water rights, and operations here in the Lower Elkhead Creek Valley. There's also an environmental component, and we're trying to restore the riparian corridor and improve in-stream aquatic habitat and water quality. Planned restoration efforts on Lower Elkhead Creek will include regrading vertical banks, installing tow rock, log veins, and other woody material, planting native riparian vegetation, and working together with landowners to fence off riparian areas from livestock until fully reestablished. I'm Tim O'Neill and this is my wife, Lane O'Neill, and we've lived here at the ranch here for five years. We're raising cattle here, a herd of Wagyu. In addition, uh, we like to use it recreationally. So we've uh, actually put some fish in the water and we enjoy fishing. The ultimate goal is to have it restored and as healthy as can be. So identifying, hey, that we can all work together, the, the, the water, the improvement of the water works for everyone, but we then have our own specific needs of what we would like to do. A goal for us in the future is to have some habitat um, improvement and a, the, a shelter for the fish and the, the wildlife, the birds that we see here, and improving the whole river, not just our section, but up and down knowing that will, it, it will improve the, the whole um, waterway. We've seen incredible support come out of not only our local community here in Northwest Colorado, but from state and federal agencies as well. This support and investment into the project has been critical, not only for moving this project forward, but helping to share the financial burden with those individual landowners who have been most affected by these ongoing issues. We could not do a project like this on our own. It is very expensive and without the help and the resources that are out there, we could not do this project on our own. We have been, for the last 30 years, voicing our concerns and we have finally got a hold of the right people, the right agencies that are willing to help us. Through this IWMP process and once we identify projects, we can strategically coordinate funding and help streamline the planning and implementation process and help individuals or groups wanting to get these projects done actually get projects in the ground. The Lower Elkhead Creek Restoration Project is the kind of project that the Roundtable wants to spur towards action. 
Learn more about the work of the Yampa White Green Basin Roundtable and its integrated water management plan at yampawhitegreen.com.